Hello everyone. In this INR number 85, I am going to tell you about another uh, important topic in the PSM that is biomedical waste management, right? So what is uh, in this biomedical waste management we have to remember, see in India it is covered by EPA which is Environment Protection Act which started in 1986 and it was revised latest in the 2016 right under section 6 8 and 25 so these are the sections where it has been included and this comes under the ministry of environment and forest and climate change right so it has a four schedules so these are schedule 1 2 3 and 4 so what is schedule 1 schedule 1 is for categorization segregation processing treatment and disposal right schedule 2 is for standard for the treatment and disposal schedule 3 is for authorities and the duties and schedule 4 is important for us because this will include the labels of bmw bags and the containers right and this is the logo of biomedical waste management right so this is the logo of biomedical waste management so in that what we have seen that biomedical waste management color coding has been given in the according to the schedule number four right so in india we are following these four bag four colors codes yellow color red color white color and blue color right so in yellow color what are the important things see those who are repeat questions i have made them with the green color so these are all earlier repeat pyqs so in yellow in the yellow color what we are going to have human and anatomical human and it should be animal right so by mistake it came as a anatomical human and animal anatomical waste will be coming here and example will be placenta blood bags remember this is important pyq blood bags in the yellow container soil gauge culture plate live vaccine oils cytotoxic or expired drugs and microbiology biotechnology and other clinical lab waste all these things will be in the yellow bag right chemical waste and chemical liquid is waste all will be going into the yellow bag right so these are human anatomical and animal anatomical waste blood bag soil gauge culture plate live vaccine oil cytotoxic or expired drug these are all going for yellow bag right in red color you will be using recyclable or contaminated waste so in this what we are going to use euro bag foley's catheter vacutainer syringes without needles gloves and catheter so these are important things so in red you have to remember you are going to see the euro bag so if euro bag was the question in the exam so euro bag is for red color right white is a puncture proof container what they will be uh, having sharp waste whatever sharp waste will be there that will be kept in the white color so these are having syringes and needles sharps surgical blades and scalpels right so surgical blade scalpel syringes with needles all these things will be kept inside the white one blue will be having glass like a lab slide which we are using and metallic body implants so remember this was the question in exam so blue will be having orthopedic implants or pacemaker so blue will be having orthopedic implants and pacemaker so now all these green color are our pyqs which examiner had asked in exam right so what will be uh, for the covid 19 biomedical waste management yellow bag and red bag what are the contents so whatever in the uh, blue color these are all pyqs so yellow color will be having head cover shoe cover mask linen gowns and patient soil tissues all these things apart from this you have to remember discarded medicine so all these things will be in the yellow bag in red bag you will be having personal protective uh, equipment that ppe will be in the red bag and hazmat shoot will be also in the red bag nitrile gloves face shield goggles plastic coveralls all these things will be in the red one apart from that splash proof apron and syringes iv sets will be also kept in the red bag when we are using for covid 19 right what will be the color based treatment and disposal right what will be the treatment and disposal for these uh, you know biomedical waste products so in yellow bag whatever is there so remember that anatomical waste whether it is a human or animal along with soil waste you will go for incineration plasma pyrolysis and deep burial so remember these are the treatment and disposal method for anatomical waste and soil waste incineration plasma pyrolysis and deep burial when we are using expired or discarded medicine we will be using again incineration plasma pyrolysis and here there is a new method called encapsulation right so these are for expired or discarded medicine so you are seeing encapsulation has been included 
chemical waste we are using again incineration plasma pyrolysis and encapsulation so i can say that this uh, incineration plasma pyrolysis and encapsulation is for expired or discarded medicine also and it is for chemical waste also when we are seeing the red bag content we will be using autoclaving or microwaving or hydroclaving after that it will be followed by shredding or mutilation right shredding or mutilation so autoclaving microwaving or hydroclaving followed by shredding or mutilation or combination of sterilization and shredding will be done for this right for white puncture proof we will be using autoclaving dry heat sterilization so here you will be using dry heat sterilization followed by shredding or mutilation or encapsulation in metal container or cement concrete right so encapsulation will be in the metal container or cement concrete for the white right and we may use combination of shredding cum autoclaving also for the white bag so for blue color disinfection by soaking the washed glass waste after cleaning with the detergent and sodium hypochlorite treatment so first we will do the dis disinfection or through the autoclaving or microwaving or hydroclaving and then we will be sending it for the recycling so these are the method of the treatment and disposal for these color bags right so keep revising these topics and they can be again in your exam my best wishes to all of you